Okay, he's here. All right. Um, so uh, I'll I'll get back to you about you when we can get the children together. Okay. okay. Hi, Paul. Hi, Carl. So, uh, how's your day so far? Oh, it's great. Um, Jordan's gone, Kevin's asleep. It's just you and me. There was something that I wanted to say to you, but well, before I could say it, you you kissed me. I... <laughs> Look, when you moved in here, you said it was because you wanted to protect me from James. This changes everything. What do you want? I want you. Look, Paul, I had a lovely time with you last night. And we've been friends for a very long time, and that means the world to me. Me too. And I can't tell you how much it means that you saved Cabot from the fire that... What do you think? Come on, you think I'm here for some kind of a merit badge? I... No, I... I just thought that you were still trying to make things up to me. Doing penance for exposing Cabot's illegal adoption. Well, maybe... Maybe that is what it was at first, but... Now it's more. For me, anyway. I... Really? It's news to me. Come on. I... It was on our last night. I kissed you on the cheek, right? And you tried to pretend that nothing happened, but something happened. I know that. I, 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 I think you know that, too. Well, Paul, I, I uh... Look. Okay, I, I, I mean, I need, to, I need to say this. I mean, maybe you want to ignore it, how it is that you feel, but... I've reached a point in my life where I will no longer ignore how I feel. Come on. Am I just imagining things? And there is a possibility for us, isn't there? So how's Cabot? Sleeping like a baby. Great. Maybe we can get back to what we were talking about before. Sure. Uh, I have to ask you a question, though. Um, how long have you been feeling this way? I think the possibility was always there. Even when you were with Craig and I was with Rose. Wait, I beg your pardon? You're gonna stand there and tell me that you never wondered what would have happened if we'd both been free? That your cool million Craig wondered. Yes, he did. You know he did. He was very jealous. Well, maybe he just sensed something that you and I didn't have the nerve to admit. 
There's more to you and me than, than, than a friendship, Rosanna. It doesn't seem to be going anywhere. Come on, you? You're, you're speechless? You... I'm out on a limb here. Could you, could you say something? I... So I'm just imagining things. Maybe not. Maybe, just... Maybe, Rosanna, you feel something for me, too. Maybe you're right. Maybe I do feel something more for you than friendship. But... Everything around us has changed. The situation with Cabot is so tenuous. I can't think about what I want no, don't, don't, or getting into don't a relationship. Not now. Rosanna, listen. You, you're a, a fabulous mother to Cabot, but there is more to you than being a mother. Don't, don't close yourself off from whatever it is that you want. Well, I know that. I, I know that, and you're right. But there are more people to consider here than just you and me. Jordan. Yes, Jordan. I think that we've come to some sort of understanding, but I can't get into a relationship or be distracted until I'm absolutely sure that nothing's going to threaten Cabot. I understand that. You need to understand something. You and I could have something spectacular. I know that. So, although I'm sorry that you don't feel like this is the right time for you or you feel like you got something else going on or whatever it is, if you feel that somehow whatever it is that you want doesn't matter. This thing, whatever it is, has a life of its own. So you do whatever it is that you have to do. But know this, I'm here. And I'm waiting. Yeah, so... So, I was thinking maybe that I wouldn't go into the office today, but work at, well, from home. And it's bad enough I got to share a roof with Jordan. I don't, I don't share everything with the guy. Meaning me? Mm-hmm. Well, it must be difficult for you carrying a torch for a married woman. I'll manage. Listen, if you feel uncomfortable staying here... Rosanna, I said to you that I would stay here until you and Cabot were safe from Stenbeck. That's exactly what I'm going to do. I mean, and, you know, unless you don't want me underfoot all day. No, it's okay. Make yourself at home. I'll do that. <laughs> 